Welcome. Holiday prices on all items in celebration of Maester Seymour Guado's wedding. Too expensive, you think? How about this? I'll go with these prices for a while. Wait. It is here. Somewhere. What's here? Something you should see. But... Sir Oren... It won't take long. This place, it's just water, isn't it? This is what spheres are made of. It absorbs and preserves people's memories. What's that? Fiends are also attracted to these places. Whoa, this is old. Don't know if you can play it back. Jacked. Left it here ten years ago. <sighs> play it back. Mm-hmm. What are you taking? Well, you said it was gonna be a long trip. We'll be seeing a lot of neat things, right? So I thought I'd record it all in this. To show to my wife and kid, you know. This is no pleasure cruise. Hey, Braska. Ain't this supposed to be a grand occasion? Where are the cheering fans, the crying women? This is it. Too many goodbyes. People think twice about leaving. If you say so. Well, it better be a lot more colorful when we come back. A parade for Braska, vanquisher of sin. <laughs> we should go. Day will break soon. Oren, could you stand closer to him? Good. That should do it. What's the matter? Afraid I might bite? Jack. Braska, you should take one too. It'll make a great gift for little Yuna. 
I suppose. Lord Braska, we shouldn't be wasting our time like this. What's the hurry, man? Ugh. Let me tell you what the hurry is. Oren. What's the point? He wasn't on some pleasure cruise. I think there's more. Understand, but you know what? There's a time when you have to stop crying and move on. You'll be fine. Remember, you're my son. And, well, ah, uh, never mind, I'm no good at these things. He sounded almost serious, but it was too late. He was serious. Jacked had already accepted his fate. His fate? Jacked, he... He was always talking about going home to Zanarkand. That's why he took all those pictures, to show them to you when he returned. But as he journeyed with us and came to understand Spira, and Braska's resolve. It happened gradually, but Jekt changed. He decided he would join Braska in his fight against Sin. So then, he gave up going home? That was his decision. I guess I understood. My old man, he knew there was no way back home, back to Zanarkand. He wanted to go home, but he knew he couldn't. He couldn't go on until he accepted it. Besides, even if he had found a way back, I don't think he would have left his friends behind before their journey was complete. All right, let's go, guys. Maybe I had to start accepting my own fate. Wait. Yeah? Jekt loved you. Oh, come on, please. He just didn't know how to express it, he said. Enough about my old man, okay? I just thought you should know. Okay. Thanks. This road leads to Bevel. You should hurry to the temple in Makalania. We're on watch duty at the temple at least until the wedding's done. Anyone tries to crash our party, we'll send them packing. We've received several reports of summoners disappearing these last few days. 
Please be careful, my lady. When our assignment here is done, we will be heading north. Hopefully, we will catch some chocobos and rebuild our unit. called Jekt, the man from Xanarkin, are you not? What of it? Watch your tongue, Knave. Ah, my apologies. I am Braska, a summoner. I've come to take you from this place. Mm, sounds sweet. What's the catch? <laughs> that easy to see, was it? I soon leave on a pilgrimage to Xanarkin. Seriously? Hmm. I would like you to join us. It will be a dangerous trip. Yet, if we do reach Xanarkin, my prayers will be answered, and you will be able to go home, we think. What say you? Great, let's go! Hmm. So quick? Anything to get out of here! Then it's settled. But I must protest. This drunkard, a guardian? Hey! You wanna step in here and say that? What does it matter? No one truly believes that I, a fallen summoner, wed to an albed could possibly defeat sin. This is what they say. No one expects us to succeed. Braska, sir. <laughs> Let's show them they're wrong. A fallen summoner, a man from Xanarkin, and a warrior monk doomed to obscurity for refusing the hand of the priest's daughter. What delightful irony it would be if we defeated sin. Stop gabbing and get me out of here! <sighs> Free at last! Now, Jekt. I am in your hands until we reach Xanarkand. Right, right. So, what's a summoner anyway? You look at this, they always leave me behind. Oh, you want me to scratch you? There, good boy. <laughs> How'd you know what it wanted? Uh, I've always been able to tell how chocobos feel. Maybe I'd make a better chocobo breeder than chocobo knight, huh? Hey, what job do you see me doing? I think so too. Hmm. You know, I might just give it a try. Curse that ring for taking up a place like this. He'll be rich by tomorrow, all on account of this celebration thing. Hmm? What? You buying something from me? Great! I knew I could count on you, lad. Yuna's really quiet. I've heard Lady Yuna is to wed Maester Seymour. It is great news. I'd like to congratulate her. 
But it is a pity. I'd hoped Lady Una would defeat Sin and bring the calm to Spira. Yuna's still gonna journey, even after she's married. Ah, oh, that is also great news. Her resolve is admirable. Can we go now? I'm tired of waiting. Seriously? A wedding's not supposed to make people feel this bad, huh? Come on, don't say that. Hm. Uh, I say what I want, ever since I was a kid. Oh, so you're an adult now? You know it. Anything can happen. Make sure you're prepared, right? Temple not far. Why stop here? Don't forget to smile, remember? Oh, you're right. I'll try and remember. Lady Yuna, we've been expecting you. We were surprised you decided to come so soon. Pleasantly surprised, of course. <laughs> Lord Seymour sends his apologies for having left without notice. It's quite all right. I have one question, if I may, sir. Milady? I want to keep journeying, even if I marry. Do you think that Maester Seymour would let me? But of course, Milady. Lord Seymour wishes nothing else, I'm sure. Goodbye. Well, we must follow Grotto tradition. I'll have to ask you to wait here a little while longer. I'll send someone to escort you. I... We're all with you. Do as you will. Thank you. Sorry. That was your line. Yuna! <laughs> yes, sir! Oh, no! I'll bet!
Milady. Riku! Ich, ich fäm dann wie dran. Eis Tragadien auf Juna. Wika? Juna kwa. Fafem Kindran. Krak kwa. Tu dreck je moha, Kegden. I told him I was a guardian. Well, I guess I had to, really. How come you speak out bed? Why? Uh, well, uh... Because I'm out bed. And that was my brother. You knew? Mm. Hmm. Why didn't you tell me? We knew you'd be upset. This is great. I can't believe I've been traveling with an out bed, a heathen. You're wrong. We have nothing against Yevon. But you out bed used the forbidden machina. You know what that means? Sin was born because people use machina. You got proof? Show me proof. It's in Yevon's teaching. Well, not that you know. That's not good enough. Yevon says this, Yevon says that. Can't you think for yourself? Well, then you tell me. Where did sin come from, huh? I... I don't know. <laughs> you badmouth Yevon, and that's all you can come up with. But... That doesn't mean you should do whatever they say without thinking. Nothing will ever change that way. Nothing has to change. You want Sin to keep coming back? There might be a way to stop it, you know? Sin will be gone once we atone for our past mistakes. When? How? If we keep faith in Yevon's teachings, it will be gone one day. Why do I even bother? Riku. Hmm? Will this move? Yes! We're not using that, are we? Wait. Sir Aron is an outbet too, is he? Come on, Waka. What? I mean, getting angry just because you found out Riku's an outbed. You guys got along fine till now, didn't you? That's different. I mean... Well, I don't claim to know that much about Spira. And I probably know even less about the Albed, but I know Riku's a good person. She's just Riku. No. Just think of this as an opportunity to learn more about the Albed. Ha! <coughs> Let him go. Give him time to think. I'm sorry. You've done nothing to apologize for. Let's ride! You sure you know how to drive this? Better than Kamari does. I hope that you're not too mad at Waka. Hey, not at all! <sighs> Thank you. Say, what do you think of Riku? Me? She's... fun to be with. <laughs> that all? <sighs> well, I can tell she's not a bad person. Yeah. You know what the problem is? She's just another Albed to Waka. Waka's head is as hard as a rock. I bet it's because of Yevon, or, you know, something like that. Well, there's more to it than that. Hmm? Waka doesn't like the Albed because of his brother, Chaku. Oh, he used a Machina weapon, right? And got killed by Sin. Killed by my old man. Damn you, Jack. What? No, oh, nothing. Hey, can someone like a human become Sin ever? I can't say that I know, but why? Just a thought. Mm. Sin is the punishment for, and the incarnation of crimes we have committed. Mm. So no one really knows what it is? There's no need to know, so no one asks. You run or you fight. That is really all you can do. There's no sense brooding over it. What, that's all? 
I mean, you don't even wonder? <laughs> you really do come from a world where there is no sin, like you say. Halt! The likes of her are not welcome in this hallowed place. She is a guardian. A, an all bed? A guardian? Preposterous! I've decided to be Yuna's guardian now. And that's all I want. And that's all one needs to be a guardian. Very well. 